Health insurance. Why is it so important? And what are the advantages and disadvantages? This and much more in today's video. Hello and welcome to the business class, your YouTube channel, where you learn all about the topic money. Although money and wealth are not everything, you barely get anywhere without in our modern day society. Seemingly everyone nowadays wants to be rich, famous and live a life in wealth but of course not everyone will manage to do so. However, if you are determined, focused and working hard, you will be able to achieve your goals. So do no longer waste your potential, do no longer wait for your luck to happen from alone, improve yourself every single day and you will soon start to see the fruits of your success. With my videos, I want to provide you with motivation, knowledge and inspiration, so that you can reach your goals as fast as possible and make the best out of your life. If you have general interest in content about topics like make money online, stocks, luxury and lifestyle, subscribe to the channel and press the bell button, to not miss a single video. Also write a comment with your suggestions and wishes, which content you would like to see more often. And now let's start. Health insurance is really important and here is why. Having health insurance makes it easier to access health care, which leads to lower mortality rates and better health care outcomes. Health insurance can mean the difference between sickness and health or life and death. The benefits of health insurance and why they are important. The financial benefits of health insurance. One of the main functions of health insurance is to make health care more affordable by protecting us from the financial consequences of accidents and unexpected illnesses that can easily turn into thousands or tens of thousands of dollars. A healthy or young person may think that health insurance is an expense they can waive and don't need because they are rarely sick and have never been in the hospital. However, accidents and illnesses can happen to us at any time. Without health insurance, you are at great financial risk because you will have to pay the full cost of medical expenses. For example, a broken leg from an unexpected fall could cost you almost $8,000 in medical expenses. Without insurance, you will be responsible for all costs. However, if you have good insurance, you may only have to pay 20% of that amount, or about $1,600. Having health insurance can have an even greater effect in severe cases because you can avoid large medical bills and protect your financial assets. A three-day hospitalization can cost more than $30,000, and these costs would be unaffordable without health insurance to cover at least part of the cost. A cancer diagnosis can cost hundreds of thousands of dollars and without insurance can lead to financial ruin. In these critical situations, the co-payment limit set by your health insurance plan limits the amount you will spend on medical expenses over the course of a year. Once your expenses reach that limit, the plan will cover 100% of your expenses for covered medical services, no matter how much your total medical expenses are. However, you must pay a monthly premium. Most insurance plans also cover prescription drugs, making them affordable for millions of people. This plays an important role in the care and treatment of chronic conditions and diseases. More than 45% of the U.S. population relies on prescription drugs to treat conditions and stop disease progression, which helps prevent costly medical complications, including hospitalizations. However, without health insurance, the cost of many prescription drugs would be prohibitive and financially unaffordable for millions of Americans. Benefits of Insurance Health insurance connects people to regular sources of care and allows them access to an infrastructure and network of providers who can work with patients to provide comprehensive, continuous and coordinated health care services. Ultimately, people can live longer and healthier lives because they have access to a continuum of care. Most health insurance plans offer preventive services, and many vaccinations and checkups are free, which can help prevent illness and related complications. Health insurance also covers pre-existing conditions. This means that even if you were diagnosed before joining the program, you are still eligible for medical benefits. With health insurance, both patients and providers are better able to focus on prevention, health care and treatment of acute and chronic conditions, resulting in better health outcomes and lower costs. In contrast, without health insurance, the opposite is true. More illness, more costs, and even death. Health insurance provides peace of mind. Having health insurance also reduces stress. 
It also relieves anxiety about big medical bills and provides peace of mind. At the same time, health insurance gives us confidence that we will have access to comprehensive health care and not have to worry about being out of the health care system. Health insurance also gives us a sense that we are part of the health care system and that we are, in fact, taking care of ourselves by having a health care provider that we can rely on on an ongoing basis. A little hint for you, if the content of the video is important to you and you want to benefit from it in the future, you can easily save the video to your playlist or click on, watch later, so that you can watch it again at any time you want. Or, if you don't watch this video as a logged in member, just save the video as a bookmark in your browser, to always have easy access to it. There are other, less obvious, but important benefits of healthcare. For example, having health insurance reduces the amount of paperwork for the insured. Health insurance maintains a patient's medical records, recording current treatment and medical history. As a result, patients may not have to fill out forms during the treatment phase. In addition, if patients are insured, it is easier for them to bill for services and they don't have to spend time filling out financial forms. Health insurance can also get rid of the stigma of being uninsured. People without insurance may feel marginalized and stigmatized. For example, they may feel that not having insurance is a signal to society that they are negligent, that they cannot afford health insurance, or that not having insurance is irresponsible. As a result, they may be less likely to seek treatment and care until their condition or illness progresses to a more serious stage. Conversely, people with insurance are more likely to be involved in the healthcare system, going to their doctors not only for emergency care, but also for routine care, such as annual physicals and checkups. Disadvantages and caveats of health insurance. Health insurance, while important, is not a panacea. Health insurance has its problems and disadvantages. For example, health insurance is expensive and often places a heavy monthly burden on the family budget. In addition, even the best insurance plans require you to pay some medical expenses, including deductibles, co-payments and co-insurance. There may be years when you have little or no need for medical care, but you still have to pay monthly premiums and other health-related expenses. In these cases, you may find yourself paying for coverage you don't use or need. Also, health insurance may have coverage limits or restrictions. In these cases, it is important to read the fine print, as sometimes there may be gaps in treatment, which can ruin your care. In addition, Health insurance increasingly relies on a more limited network of providers to control the use and cost of services, which in turn limits consumers' choice of healthcare providers. Health insurance can be flawed in other ways as well. Health insurance may provide for a 12-month waiting period for treatment of certain pre-existing conditions. Occupational insurance may provide for an 18-month waiting period for treatment of certain pre-existing conditions for those who were enrolled late workers who enrolled after the initial enrollment period. In some cases, consumers may have little or no leverage in negotiating with health insurance systems. For example, the insurance company decides what services are provided, what services are covered, and how much. Insurers may also have an advantage in the appeals process if claims are denied. Most health insurance policies do not cover elective procedures, brand new technology, or off-label use of medications, prescriptions used to treat conditions or diseases for which the medication is not approved. Whether it's worth having insurance. Having health insurance is a smart investment in your health, an investment that will keep you and your family healthy and reduce the burden of health care costs. Not having insurance is the leading cause of death among adults. So having insurance is always a good idea. Why health insurance is so expensive. The cost of health insurance is largely driven by the cost of treating long-term illnesses, taking care of an aging population and the cost of new drugs, procedures and technology. In addition, the insurance industry is consolidating, resulting in fewer insurers, less competition and, consequently, higher premiums. And if one day, you want to build up your own business or you have one already and want it to grow much bigger and faster, always have in mind, that starting a successful business and earning money, takes time. You need perseverance and a lot of stamina. It's like you growing a small plant right from the seed, you never know how fast it will grow, how tall it will get and how many fruits you will be able to collect. It is the same with every business, some work great, 
Some flop and some could become very successful. But people way to often resign much too early. So follow my advices, try out different methods and sooner or later, you will find the one that suits you the most, that fits best to your skills and knowledge and you will have a well-earning business. No matter, if you want to make money online, by affiliate marketing, drop shipping or even stocks, everything is possible. And even though, growing a business and making money, can sometimes be a lengthy and tedious issue, it's all worth it at the end. Just stay focused to your goals, work smart and hard, spend your time and resources effectively, be persistent and sooner or later, you will have success, you will reach your goals and earn enough money to live the life you ever dreamed of. I hope this video was helpful for you and I was able to impart knowledge to you, give you new ideas or simply inspire and motivate you to change your life in a positive way. If so, please leave a like and write me your opinion and content requests in the comments. If you have general interest in content about topics like make money online, stocks, luxury and lifestyle, subscribe to the channel and press the bell button to not miss a single video. Thank you very much for your interest and especially for your time. And hopefully, we see us in the next business meeting.